Jay. The Tower of Terror at California Adventure is the best one ever. Bradley, you are straight up tripping. Everybody knows that the original, the best, is in Hollywood Studios in Orlando, Florida. Wow, guys, look. They got the tree up already. Oh, wow. <laughs> Nana is always ready. He looks gorgeous always in here. Always ready. Anyway, Bradley, come on, be sensible about this. This is the first, the original Hollywood Studios. The Tower of Terror is unlike any other. The Tower of Terror California Adventure feels so much better. It feels real, drops faster, and I actually feel like I might die in a haunted hotel. Oh gosh, okay Josh, what do you think? Y'all know, I'm just terrified of them both, but you know what? I'm waiting for Pandora to come out in 2017. That's gonna be That's gonna be fun. for that. But seriously, Bradley, Florida, come on, they got the best one. RJ, California Adventure, it's the best. Hands down. How are we gonna settle this? Route 66 Paul, he can help. Oh yeah. 66 Paul, what do we think of that? Yeah. Well, how do we call him? It's simple, we just sing the song. Oh, okay. First make a little room though, make a little room. Get your kicks on Route 66. Okay, that's me, Bradley, RJ, and jo Guys, what's going on here? I was giving Santa Claus my Christmas hey, list. Hey Paul. Settle a, dis a dispute for us. Oh, okay. Uh, I think the Tower of Terror in California Adventure is so much better. And RJ here... Thinks the right answer. Maybe I should say knows. The first, the original, in Florida is absolutely the best. What do you think, Paul? Well, oh, guys, there's only one way to solve this. Let's go to California Adventure. Then we'll go to Hollywood Studios. We'll make, And I will make the final determination as to which one is the best. That okay. Sounds good. That sounds fair. All right. All right. Let me get my keys. Did you want to? I'll check the map. map. Guys, guys, guys. Route sixty six, Paul. Um, okay. Everybody has their annual passes. Well, not on me right no, now. Sure. No. No. All right. Look, don't worry. We'll pick them up on the way. Okay. And by the way, young people, we never cheat our way into Disneyland or Walt Disney World. We always have our annual passes, and ours have no blackout dates. And we let security know in advance that we're on our way. We don't want to scare anybody. All right, <laughs> ladies, guys. You guys ready? Yeah. Let's go. Hey, Walt Disney on three. Ready? Yeah. One, two, three. Walt, Walt Disney. Disney. Oh, this is the bathroom. Bradley, why are you on the toilet? And where'd you get that magazine? Oh, well, at least you're reading about the 150th anniversary of the Buffalo Soldiers. <laughs> All right, look, guys, concentrate. Okay, Walt Disney on three. One, two, three. Walt, Walt Disney. Disney. Well, at least we're outside. Yeah, but we're now we're by Paul's pool. Bradley, why are you gonna towel in trunks? I thought about swimming. Oh, come on, guys, concentrate. Right. Walt Disney on three. One, two, three. Walt, Walt Disney. Disney. Where's Bradley? Oh man, who knows what he was thinking about this time. My brother, his mind is always drifting somewhere. Okay, look guys, we don't have time to worry about Bradley. Let's go check out the attraction. When we get done, we'll head down to Walt Disney World. Maybe he'll catch up with us. Let's do it. Let's go. Where those guys go now? I had to get my ears. Oh, hey, Paul, guys, wait up. Wow, that was much better than I thought. I told you, California Adventure Tower Terror is so much better. I'm not impressed at all. The best one is in Florida. When can we get there? Josh, you okay? You know, I don't think I ever have to do it again. <laughs> okay, look, let's head down to Walt Disney World and we'll check out the tower there. All right, right Walt Disney on three? Yeah. One, two, three, Walt, Walt Disney. Disney.
bricks and the glitter of a bustling young movie town at the height of its golden age, the Hollywood Tower Hotel was a star in its own right, a beacon for the show business elite. Now, something is about to happen that will change all that. Tonight's story in the Twilight Zone is somewhat unique and calls for a different kind of introduction. This, as you may recognize, is a maintenance service elevator, still in operation, waiting for you. We invite you, if you dare, to step aboard because in tonight's episode, you are the star. And this elevator travels directly to the Twilight Zone. 1939. The Hollywood Tower Hotel was a star. A beacon for the show business elite. Until five people step through the door of an elevator and into a nightmare. Now that door has opened once again. For you. What are we doing here? Oh, hey guys, I heard that Brittany and Maddie are moving to El Paso because Jonathan is now stationed there and they're going to be with him. They're going to be leaving, leaving soon. I know we didn't want to miss that party. Yeah, yeah. that's right. Hey, Josh, now look, you've been in power repair twice now. Are you over that fear? Oh, yeah, I am pumped. You know, we should actually go over there right now. Yeah, yeah. Right. you know it's closed, right? They're reopening as Guardians of the Galaxy. Yeah. Oh, really? It's, it's going to be the same, though, right? Oh, yeah. yeah. I think it might <laughs> a be a little different, intense. though. <laughs> oh, okay. Hey, but we'll hold you to that. <laughs> <laughs> so, Paul, you've seen both of them. Tell this guy that the one at California Adventure is the best Tower of Terror And tell him ever. that there's nothing like the original Disney's Hollywood studio. Oh, guys, gosh, guys, guys. On. You know, I've given this a lot of thought. And really, when you think about Walt Disney and Disneyland and why he created them to begin with, he wanted to be an all-encompassing experience for the family, where a father could take his children away from the boardwalks and, and, and the other issues of the parks of that time and have a place where the family could come and really enjoy themselves, an all-encompassing experience. He wanted you to go to Adventureland and have a real adventure, or go down Main Street and have an ice cream cone, or sit in the park and watch people play. He did, uh, Disneyland wasn't designed where you have a favorite this or a favorite that. He wanted it to be a total experience where it was all enjoyed the same. You understand? Actually, that makes a lot of sense. I feel kind of foolish. I get it. I get it. But on another note, at Disneyland's California Adventure, Soaring Over California is so amazing. Bradley, it's it's all the about best one yet. Walt Disney on is three, the best Soaring three, there is. Walt Disney. I don't know what your deal is, dude. Oh my goodness. Josh, Josh, tell this man, my dear brother, that it is the best one at California Adventure. Best friend, let this little guy know that absolutely, totally, completely, it's all about Epcot. Oh we fly God. over Spaceship Earth. Pa, take me with you. Come on, Josh. Josh, what are you talking Bradley, about? Bradley, you're tripping. I don't want to hear it. Where's the food? 